Hey, Herb Dean, um, your lips are moving. And so when it's a question about the uh, Jamie Hara uh, rhino fight, we know you're lying, homeboy, because uh, if you do your job and actually pretend that it's a fucking cage and he can't hold on to go to the ground, Jamie's fighting for a title because the dude is still sucking to get his breath back. You know what I'm saying? Or, uh, you know, maybe he uh, got broke off in a fucking arm bar or something, but Jamie's a predator, dude. And uh, he, <laughs> it's like this, man. This is this guy's backyard, and uh, you were taking your cue from the people that run the fucking show. What is it, PFC? Something like that. And uh, you did the same thing. When I fought Carter Williams, homie, remember when I landed a right hand on Carter? It was like the first six seconds of the fight, and Carter's a lefty, and I'm dialed in. And so, uh, you know, I launched a right hand, kind of like the same one that I took Rick Bardell out, and it was a little short, but it hit him in the chin, and his knees felt it, and uh, he didn't want to fucking uh, take the chance that I was going to do that over and over and over, and, you know, finally, I was going to cash in. And so he kicked me in the nuts. Remember that hurt about 180 miles an hour? Kind of like Dale Earnhardt going into a brick wall. And uh, funny thing about that, my ex, she was worried about my conditioning, even though I was in the best shape of my life. Uh, so you know what she did, Herb? She made me these little special concoctions, and they had uh, some bomb methamphetamine in them, okay? And, uh, yeah, I drank two of them before that fight. So that little delayed reaction, when I get kicked in the nuts and I look at you and I point to my nuts and, boom, I hit the ground, that's like dinosaur effect, dude. That was methamphetamine fucking uh, making it slow to get to my brain that, you know what, danger, you're about to go down. You know what I'm saying? And uh, it's like this, homie. Uh, you're lying, Herb. Uh, if you do your job, Jamie wins that fight. And the fact of the matter is, uh, whose side are you on, man? Uh, that's why they give you a job, because you'll do what the promoter wants. And you know what? Isn't that how it works? And you know what, Rhino? Count yourself lucky that you weren't in a cage, dude. And I bet you, I bet you, homie, uh, if you're cool, that, uh, you know, there's no reason to fucking uh, take it in deep, you know, get any further, whatever, you know. Uh, but if you weren't, I bet you, when I was rich, that you would not accept this offer. Uh, a fight to the death in the cage, okay, and you know what, uh, I bet you Jamie would fucking, uh, come out victorious, if you can't hold on to it and stand up, you go to the ground, he breaks you off, and you know what, uh, nah, we wouldn't even want to fucking go there, but it is what it is, Herb, so, uh, it's like this, man, what I would suggest you do, Herb, is, uh, go to znaturalfoods.com to get some stevia, but you know what, it seems like they're sold out for a little bit, because I think a lot of people are listening to my words, and word is starting to spread. And uh, what I would do if I were you is uh, get yourself on Stevie with a quickness and melt the fuck down. Or you know what? I might verbally spank you, okay, in the future, okay? And how easy would it be, Doc? You know, uh, there'd be a lot of people looking for it. But since everybody sees you on television, Herb, and if you go from chunky soft to lean and uh, ripply like I am, uh, It'll cause a ripple effect, and it'll actually get you more pussy, homie, because, uh, you know what, your name can only go so far with that fucking mug, you know what I'm saying, you feel me? <laughs>